Happy Friday. It's your boy, let us pray. Hope you're having a blessed and prosperous day. Um, you gotta address the elephant in the room real quick. Dallas Cowboys. Get manhandled. Get spurred. Uh, get lassoed. Uh, get gunned down at high noon by those grizzly Chicago Bears. I don't know what happened to the Cowboys. Um, some people legitimately had a great case by picking them to go to the Super Bowl this year. But I'll say it once. I'll say it again. Anytime you have a holdout situation, and I'm not saying that Ezekiel Elliott is the reason that uh, the Cowboys have been losing. But anytime you have a holdout situation with a star player, I do not see those teams doing well in the uh, regular season. It's a distraction. Um, it takes those players uh, about two to three, maybe even four games, usually about three games, three weeks or so, to get uh, back in shape, especially if they're running back. Um, takes them a while. It's just a distraction to the whole team. Um, Cowboys started off pretty well, but... And it's not even the offense that's the problem. The defense has been terrible. The defense has been shredded. The guy shredded by Mitch Trubisky. The guy who said, please turn off the TV in the locker room because I don't want to hear the media talking bad about me. This same guy is a guy who just threw for three touchdowns and ran for one last night against the Cowboys. That's just unexcusable. Um, pass defense was, I think they got one interception last night, uh, Cowboys, and one forced fumble. Um, but other than that, man, their defense has looked horrible. Tons of holes in that defense. Tons of holes in that secondary. Um, and, you know, the Bears, they don't have, you know, world beaters for wide receivers. Uh, Allen Robinson is their best receiver. Taylor Gabriel was out. Uh, their top tight end was out. Or top tight end been on IR. The backup tight end was out. Uh, the third string tight end had a big game. Anthony Miller, I think, scored a touchdown. Um... I don't even know who the other guys were that caught the touchdowns on the Bears. I don't even know their names, man. Um, well, it's got to be embarrassing. My question to uh, NFL fans and to Cowboys fans, what will it take for Jason Garrett to get fired? That's what I'm going to name this video. What will it take for Jason Garrett to get fired? If he doesn't get fired after this season, then I don't know what's going on in Dallas. Because um, the Cowboys are really bad right now. Um, they have a solid team. They got one of the best offensive lines, if not the best, in the league. They have um, top three running back. Um, Dak Prescott, He, you know, he struggled a little bit um, in the second half of the season, but he came out looking really good. Um defense has you know not been the defense that they were last season but even last season they made it to the playoffs when the offense was struggling the defense was playing really good um i know they had some injuries this year leighton vanderesh young neck roll they call him in the streets um he's been injured that's made a big impact but um they got a stacked team man amari cooper dak uh ezekiel elliott they got the Pollard kid behind Ezekiel. They got uh, Michael Gallup, Randall Cobb, Jason Witten even came back. Uh, 
Jarwin or whatever his name is, Blake Jarwin. I mean, um, they got a nice little stacked team, man. Not understanding what's going on with the Cowboys. Let me know. Is Jason Garrett done in the Big D? It's your boy. Let us pray. Hope you're having a blessed and prosperous day. TGIF to you. Happy Friday. Hope you will be doing something fun tomorrow over the weekend. I hear it's going to be storming, though. So uh, please be safe out in the streets. Drive safely. Um, if you're going to the malls, if you're going to uh, the stores, please be safe. There's been a rash of burglaries and robberies all around Northern California. Um, Metro PCS stores getting robbed. Jewelry stores getting robbed. UPS trucks getting robbed. Uh, man, people are just getting out of hand. So um, be safe out there. Watch your surroundings. Use your intuition. Something doesn't feel right, get out of there. Don't even uh, ask questions, man. If you see something that's going on, get out of there. Don't take a misstep. Go the other way. Get in your car. Leave. Um, and keep your head on the swivel, man. There's a lot of uh, roughnecks out there. A lot of... Uh, thieves thugs out there trying to make a quick dollar um at innocent people's expenses so um be blessed take care like i say man watch your surroundings it's your boy let us pray hope you have a blessed and prosperous day take care have a blessed weekend and we'll talk with you later peace so we out what's it gonna take for jason terry to get fired man what is it gonna take gary jones what's it gonna take